It is now day three in Ubud, Bali, and we are on our way to have some breakfast at Bali Buddha again. And after that, uh, we're gonna go to the Monkey Forest or Ubud Palace. And we're also going to the Ubud Market. Yeah, see you guys later. So we're done having breakfast. Um, Bali Buddha is not my favorite place in the world. It is extremely healthy and I'm more of a bacon and eggs kind of guy, but Nadia loves it. She enjoyed the breakfast. I basically ended up with having a breakfast with something that looked like a seagull barfed onto my plate. Yeah, anyways, I uh, okay. ate it all. I have something in my tummy. See you guys. Monkey Forest to the Ubud Market. It was really great. Monkeys. Flynn liked the monkeys a lot. Monkeys leaf. The monkeys are very sweet. We were kind of afraid that the monkeys were gonna jump us and grab all the food, but we didn't have any food on us actually. And the driver, Nanga, told us to stow away the drinks because that's what they really like. They like the drinks, they like the foods, but I was using my gimbal to make some good camera footage and didn't care at all. So off to the market right now. See you guys later. Here's the thing, 
since the currency in Indonesia is mostly paper-based, you spend money in terms of millions. That looks like a dot, but it's actually not. So I think since when you go eat somewhere like a lunchroom or have dinner at a warung, the tip or the service is mostly included because it says so on the receipt. Either way, I think you should tip when you're a tourist. So when you do it back home, you should do it here as well. Eating here is cheap for us tourists anyways. So don't be a cheapskate and tip people when you're staying over here. Visiting the market, we decided to call it a day because Flynn was absolutely knackered. So we threw him in the bed. He's sleeping right now, still sleeping actually, since it's about two hours out. And um, I'll be hoping to post vlog number two tomorrow, I'm working hard on the montage. Hopefully tomorrow when we go to Lake Itamani and Mount Batur, I'll be able to throw out the drone for the first time here in Bali and uh, show you guys some awesome footage. Peace. It's day four in beautiful Bali. We had a good night's rest and the sun is shining. That means I can throw out the drone and make some good footage of nature here. I've been dying to do that because Bali has some beautiful, beautiful places to see. Uh, so we're stopping over to get some genuine Balinese coffee for Nadia. And then we're off to Lake Kintamani Hot Springs. And after that, we're gonna drive up Mount Batur, see the view from on top of the mountain. So by the way, we actually have a new driver today. His name is Katuk. Say hello Katuk. Yes. Hello to How are you? <laughs> I am Katuk. I drive to Mr. Jerry, go to the Toyo de Vasa. Yeah. Uh. We're going to the hot springs or Toyo de Vasa as it's called. So Katuk is our driver for today. Uh, Nanga had a ceremony. Uh, that's uh, Neoman's cousin. So we have the whole family that's driving us this entire vacation. So that's really good. We just made a quick stop for some drone footage. This place is freaking amazing. You can see down there is where we'll be going. Those are the natural hot springs of Lake Kitamani. Over there is Mount Batur. So yeah, well, just a couple of more minutes of driving. I think about 20 minutes and then we're there. So I just had Katuk as well as my co-pilot. He was a very good uh, pilot. <laughs> 
We had a blast with the drone flying it out for about 500 meters and it looked amazing. I'm still playing around with the sunlight filters a bit, but uh, I hope the footage ended up good. So that's about it. See you guys later. You need a photo. Maak geen foto. Okay, so here's the thing, right? The thing they do understand in Bali is the whole concept of spa and wellness. We're staying at the Wellness Hot Springs or the Batum Hot Springs. It's a great place and as you can see across right there, that's where all the other tourists go. It's called Toya de Vasha. It's also a hot spring location, but it has an infinity pool. This place right here doesn't have an infinity pool, but it's close to it, you know, being an infinity pool. It's about one meter away or half a meter away from the lake and it's amazing. Just look at the view right here. Right, so we'll be having lunch right here and afterwards we're going to drive up Mount Batur and I'm off. I'm gonna enjoy swimming in the hot pools right here. See you guys later. We're done at Kintamani, Lake Kintamani actually, at the Mount Batum Hot Spring, I think it was, right? Enjoyed it a lot, spent the entire afternoon here. Katuk is now ready to drive us back to Ubud. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was really nice. We both had our well-deserved massage. Already finished. Finished. <laughs> and now we're gonna have, yeah, it was yeah. Batur Lake. Oh, yeah. sorry about that. Yeah. <laughs> Back to Ubud, have some food, and back to Frenny's home. Yeah, that's about it. We it's okay. Do, uh, we are stuck. Yes. Yep. Yeah. All right. Uh, bye. bye.